Darcy and Brooke, and we're here to talk to you about a new product. You know that the number one cause of catheter-associated urinary tract infections is obviously the catheter, right? right. So if we can get rid of indwelling Foley catheters, uh, we would have no potty anymore. So we have one more tool to use in that toolbox. This is a PrimoFit external urinary management. So this is the PrimoFit device, basically an envelope or a bag with a moisture wicking pad inside. And this uh, goes around the male anatomy and then is um, attached to a suction canister. How high do you turn that suction up to? 60 to 80. Okay, 60 to 80. And um, then it just constantly keeps wicking away any moisture to keep the patient dry. So Brooke, which patients are appropriate for the Primo Fit? So this should be used on patients who have wounds to aid in the healing of their wounds. It can also be used on bed-bound patients. And most importantly, it can be used for accurate I's and O's. Really, even with our heart failure patients and renal failure patients? Yes. So, what is an inappropriate use for this device? This should not be used as an excuse for a patient to not get out of bed. Mobility is very important. So, how do I select which size PrimoFit to use for my patient? There are not multiple sizes. The PrimoFit device is one size fits all. Well, if the anatomy is too small or inverted, this would not be appropriate. So let's demonstrate the use of the PrimoFit on our mock patient. First, you will cleanse the skin where the adhesive should come into contact. While shaving is not required, it would help just remove the backing and slide up and around the penis. Press gently to adhere the adhesive, then fold up and adhere the top adhesive to the patient's lower abdomen. Next you will attach suction Remember that we should change this out about once a day? Correct, every 24 hours. Every 24 hours. And put on a new one. So when it's time to remove the Primo Fit for daily skin checks and um, replacement, uh, just simply use an alcohol skin prep to help remove the adhesive. 